Hi. So, uh, some of you may know that I am a 21 Pilots fan. A huge 21 Pilots fan, in fact. I'm going to their concert in Tampa in November. I'm excited. But I've been wanting to do like a 21 Pilots DIY for a long time, and my mom's been getting on my back. Ah, you know, your name's Captain Yannin. You haven't even done any DIYs. Like, what the heck, man? So, um, for this DIY, it's pretty easy. If you want to use the design that I have, Let's look at the design. So this is what I printed out. I ended up not using these two because they're just so big. So I ended up using both of these on one shoe. So... So if you guys want to just like download it, I'll put a link below. It's... Yeah, I'll put a, I'll put a link down below to that because like you don't want to copy and paste it from Google onto Word. I got you fam. It's already done. So, what you're gonna need is a printer, of course, and some paper for, for your printer. You're gonna need some black shoes, um, black specifically because the background in those pictures are black, so it just looks better on a black shoe compared to a white shoe or a gray shoe. So the shoes that I got are from Walmart. They were five bucks, so I was like, hey, five dollars I'll spend five dollars so they're five bucks you can get them at Walmart also like family dollar has plain shoes as well if you want to check over there <coughs> and then you're gonna need some Mod Podge now the Mod Podge I used is the matte one because I hate the look of the glossy one it just gets on my nerves I just hate it and then you only need something to apply the Mod Podge with I used a brush. I think it came with the Mod Podge I bought. I don't know. It's it's just a brush. I don't know where it is. Now, let's get on to the DIY, friends. So first thing you want to do is, of course, print out your things and leave the paper some time to dry after you print them out. Now, make sure you have all of the supplies that I am currently throwing on the floor because they are all quite important. So you want to cut all of the pieces out and make sure that there are no pieces of white hanging out because once you put them on the shoe, you're going to see the piece of white. So make sure that you just cut all of the black parts. Now you want to get your Mod Podge. Mod Podge is vital to this here DIY. So all you're going to do with the shoes is get your Mod Podge and I poured it into the cap. Just take your brush and rub the Mod Podge on the part of the shoe that you're going to put the paper down on just to wet it and do it in sections before you cover the entire shoe with Mod Podge. Then you're going to just lay the paper down. Once you have it there, put the Mod Podge on top of the paper and make sure that the paper is completely down and completely sealed in the Mod Podge so that it won't stick up or fall off. Just do that all over the shoe and the same thing basically over and over again. And when I'm done putting all my pieces of paper down, I just go in my other shoe because it's almost done drying. I just go and I cover it completely in Mod Podge to seal everything in and also so you can't really tell the difference between the regular fabric in the shoe and where you missed putting Mod Podge down. So like make sure you cover the entire shoe or else it'll look weird. Now while we wait for our shoes to dry, Here's a 30 second jam session. playing Gary Mod Sandbox and got caught up in what I was doing and totally forgot about the shoes but here they are dude they look really good <laughs> I'm really happy like I ended up having to paint the whole shoe in the Mod Podge because it wasn't as matte as I thought it was but I left the center part out so the center part's still matte you know the regular fabric and then but yeah I tried to also copy same pattern of where I put things on each shoe I like it a lot I think they're really cool like 
<laughs> oh, I think they're so cool. I'm gonna definitely be wearing these. I'm gonna get made fun of by my friends if I ever wear them like around my friends because my friends like to make fun of me a lot. But like, dude, look at how cool they are. Like, I can't wait to show my mom because um, she's also a fan. And um, we're going to the concert together. But these are so cool. Like, I actually, they actually turned out a lot better than I thought they would. Like, you can see, if you look really close, you can see where the paper is. Like, the little edges and corners. But honestly, I don't, I don't mind. Like, I kind of like, I like it like that. And also, the paper, if you like try and pick at it it's not gonna come off because we did double layers of mud patch because we're smart we smart like that but yeah this was a quick DIY I'm gonna go I'm gonna go like show my mom quick DIY I think these turned out really great way better than I thought they would like it looks good and I like how um just the paper is shiny oh if you guys like this DIY, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, dude. And if you're a fellow 21 Pilot fan, otherwise, there's no other reason why you click this video, to be honest. But if you like 21 Pilots, why not hit that subscribe button? Because us banditos gotta stick together, part of that click. So yeah, don't forget to hit the subscribe button. I'll have more videos coming out soon. I plan on releasing my skincare, my skincare routine video, as you can see my skin now compared to ooh, I don't even have a highlight on oh my god and definitely more DIYs I want to make a 21 pilot shirt to go to the concert in like I have a whole outfit planned I'm really excited but um I will see you guys in the next video and don't forget to stay crafty bye